Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to take a look at some NASCAR Ascendic Series for you guys, but this time we have from 2022. But, this is actually a double review for this one, because I'm taking a look at two NASCARs from the same driver. So, if you guys remember the, the monthly toy haul video what I did, and plus the toy haul that I did months ago, I finally got two NASCARs that I need for my collection. So the first one I'm going to show you is... is the Irish Spring Ricky... Stenhard Jr. This is part of the Wave 6 for 2022 and the Sunny D Risk, Risk, uh, Ricky Stenhard Jr. and this one's part of for Wave 8. And before we continue on, I need you guys to do me with a quick favor, so I'll be right back. Hey you! Stop what you're doing! Like, comment, subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and enjoy your day. So anyways, uh, if I can remember, I think this one I actually got it at Target, and this one, I think also I got it from Target, also, yeah, I think I got that these two in Target, separate Targets. Um, now, why I haven't made a video for those two? Um, I was actually planning to do one, but I got caught up from other stuff, plus... I'm getting overwhelmed, getting more stressed out, and yeah, I do apologize for that. So anyways, um, this is part of the Wave 6, and this is part of the Wave 8, so let's take a look at the Irish Spring Ricky Sanhart Jr. This is one of the straight redeco of this one because you got the Kroger's card this front of it right here in redeco and the, the Irish Spring one. So yes, and of course it comes with these stickers, and I wish they made, I wish they brought it back, the magnet, the hood, because I actually do hate stickers, but yeah. You can see the back of the packaging, more diecast also available for Wave 6, I'm still missing all these right here, so yes. And I'm actually pretty got that, I'm excited to get that, and for the Sunny D one right here, you can see it's an orange, and you can see the back of the packaging right here, also other cars also available. I do have this one, the Ryan Blaney card. I did a review on months ago, so yes. All right, I'm gonna go pause the video, open it up, and show you guys the stickers and the car, and pretty much that's it. All right, so we got the, we got both of them out of the pack, out of the blister. So let's take a look at this one right here. And then of course you have the Irish Spring logo right here with the number 47, and of course you got Stenhart Jr. right there. So yes, it's not much other to say about it. It's pretty cool. And of course, you got the one from Sunny D. Pretty, pretty awesome. Got the Sunny D logo right here. And I do like what they use. This like a shade of purple with a little bit of shade of blue right there. Or it's like a darker shade of blue or something. But by the look of it, it looked like purple of it, of course. It's pretty nice. Alright, let's actually bring the camera down. And before anyone's going to ask in the comment section, yes, I am recording this in the kitchen because the... The living room has been occupied once again. Long story short, I'm actually pissed, so yeah. Focus on a stupid camera. Let's take a look at the uh, the Irish Spring car right here. So the painted sculpt of the detail on this one right here looks good. Now compare this one to the Action Racer collectible version. This one is kind of a bit look uh, shitty, so yeah. And before anyone's gonna ask, yes, is one of the PTC mold, and I know a lot of people of the NASCAR community who collect the diecast hate those molds, so yeah, and believe me, I have two cars that are absolutely shit. Now the difference between this one and the action region and then the action region collectible version is of course it's the tire rims and it doesn't have the bar on the top of it right here, and I'm not sure. What others also missing, and also the quality of it. So yeah. Before anyone's gonna ask, it does roll pretty well. No like movement, like not moving like to the left or to the right. The axles are perfectly good. And looking over the you know the decals of it right here, you got the Goodyear logo right there, and of course, of course the Goodyear logo on the tires. NASCAR Cup Series 47, the Irish Spring car, and of course you got the what it looks like on the products. Also, you got the Kroger's logo right there. Stenhard Jr. name right there. Not the sponsorship right there. Motor in the back of it right here. Of course, this car is representing a a Camaro, a Chevy Camaro CL1. Got the Kroger's logo right there. Irish Spring, and of course, more of it right here. Everything is the same thing on the other side. The front of it right here, of course, because it's a Kroger's right there. This is the blue one. 
Number 47, and you got other sponsorship in the back of it right there. Pretty nice, to be honest with you. And of course, you got Slim Jim right there, so yeah. And for the Sunny D1 right here, you guys can see, I've been actually wanting to get this for a long time because I actually do like the Sunny D D-tones right there, so yes. The painted and sculpted detailing on this one right here it looks actually pretty nice. The orange, the little bit of hints of yellow, and the different shade of the blue right there, of course, on the stickers is shown like a darker shade of purple, but this one is actually have like blue in it. Now, I may not show what is, is also the difference between these two. Unfortunately, there's a bit of a quality control problem right here. If I can zoom in, there's a gap right there, so yeah. That's also the other problem with the Lionel Racing uh, NASCAR Cynic Series is the quality control of it is 100% sucks. And before anyone's going to ask, it does also roll pretty well, no bent on the on the axle, so yes. Same thing on everything except you got the Sunny D bottle right there, if the cameras can fucking focus. Sunny D bottle right here, the Sunny D logo right here, the number 47. Everything is the same thing, minus there's no Kroger's logo right here, if you guys can see. This one does have the Kroger's logo, this one does not. The back of it right here does have the Kroger's logo right back here, but it's all covered up because of the shade of yellow right there. And of course you got the Sunny D logo right here, and of course it's the same Camaro model stock car they're using. Everything is the same thing on the other side. You can see the front of the car, Sunny D logo right here, the 47, and also the other sponsorship is also the same thing. Wait a minute, nope. Almost, yeah, almost the same thing. The only differences between is is this the sponsorship is a little bit different right here if you guys can see side by side. You can pause the video to check it out, but if I can move a little bit closer. There you go. Pause the video so you can see the difference between those two, so yeah. And yeah, that pretty much that's it. It's not much I to talk about. Is I'm actually happy they got those two in my collection because I've been actually wanting this for a long time. So yes. So if you guys are a big fan of Ricky Senhar Jr., I actually do recommend it to have this in your collection. Or if you guys are a big fan of the number 47, or if you guys love those products, this is the one for you, so yeah. Anyways, you guys, I'm going to end this right here, so yeah. Have fun and safe, and I'm always, I'm out.